car just stalled. Oh no. There's no power at all. Battery's completely dead. So I'm in the middle of nowhere. My phone is dead. It's like 20 miles to the nearest road. Wait a minute. I remember now. I have a DIY solar panel in the back of the car. What's going on guys? How's it going? Let's put together one of these little DIY solar panels. I call them junk solar panels because I'm using old cracked up cells and just random cells. So I have a simple way of attaching the cells to the glass. No, let's go. All right, so I'm putting together a junk panel. This one's gonna be a five volt panel for charging cell phones or whatever. And I've got a bunch of broken cells here, the duds from building my other panel. Top. Go. Um. Go. Okay, putting the rest of the junk panel together. Clean piece of glass here. You want this glass here? What we're gonna do now is we're gonna join them in a series circuit. You don't get that long. Bottom cell lead, top. So we have our tubes coming out. So all we gotta do now is center this onto the glass. I can just plug in my USB cable and I have a random power bank here. Bank in. That it is charging. So there's our output voltage 3D printed power bank. Little lights flashing there. 3D printed lithium battery charger. An 18650 pin type. Uh, starting to take a charge. So this panel here, you only need one piece of glass. Just use some clear window glass film. It's just like a sticker. Basically, is holding the cells onto the back of the glass. Put a little diode here to block the current from flowing back into the cells. Added a JST plug to it, and I've just put a USB plug on here, female type A plug. This panel here is good to put in a window or to have indoors. So I left this one out in the rain for a few days, and it got water underneath of the plastic, so I wouldn't... So these are the solar cells here. They're 78 by 78 millimeter. To handle them pretty carefully because they are very, very fragile. We use this film here. It's a window film. So this is a protective film for glass. So you're gonna need cells, tabbing wire, a flux pen, 951. Soldering iron. I like these little soldering irons. It's a 60 watt. You can find them all over the internet. You can use a tip like this or you can use an angle tip. Cutters or scissors. You're also going to need some electrical solder. You can find diodes in old electronics or you can just order them bulk. Little package here. So this is just a USB type A and then the JST plug. I put that on there because it makes things simple. You can just plug the connector in there. 
the car is running again, the battery was replaced. And <laughs> I'm just joking around. So maybe having a solar panel on board is a good idea. Of course, you don't have to make your own panel. You can buy them online. They're fairly inexpensive now. You don't have to do a DIY. So I like building solar panels. They're fun to put together, relaxing. Guys, thanks for watching. Take care. Peace.